In this lesson, we'll watch the story about how Chandler was trapped in an ATM vestibule with Jill Goodacre. We make English lessons like this one regularly. If you like our lessons, be sure to download our app and do the exercises for the lessons. So, let's get started. Do you like some gum? Oh, is it sugarless? <laughs> Sorry, it's not. Oh, then no thanks. What the hell was that? <laughs> mental note, if Jill Goodacre offers you gum, you take it. If she offers you mangled animal carcass, you take it. <laughs> you know, on second thought, gum would be perfection. <laughs> gum would be perfection? Gum would be perfection. Could have said gum would be nice. Could have said I'll have a stick, but no, 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 no. For me, gum is perfection. I loathe myself. Okay, what next? Blow a bubble. A bubble's good. It's got a uh, boyish charm. It's impish. Here we go. Nice going, imp. Okay, okay, it, it, it's okay. All I need to do is reach over and put it back in my mouth. Good save. We're back on track, and I'm chewing someone else's gum. This is not my gum. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And now you're choking. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. That was... That was... Perfection. <laughs> Chandler, we've been here for an hour doing this. Now watch. It's easy. Okay. Ready? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Now try it. No, you gotta whip it. <laughs> been fun yes yes thanks for uh letting me use your phone and for saving my life <laughs> well goodbye chandler i had a great blackout <laughs> see ya I'm account number 7143457, and uh, I don't know if you got any of that, but I would really like a copy of the tape. <laughs> Do you like some gum? Oh, is it sugarless? Gum, or bubble gum, or chewing gum. A soft sweet that you crush with your teeth but do not swallow. Sugarless, not containing sugar. If she offers you mangled animal carcass, you take it. Mangle. To destroy something by twisting it with force or tearing it into pieces so that its original form is completely changed. Animal carcass. You know, on second thought, gum would be perfection. On second thought. To change a decision you have made. For example, can I have a cup of tea, please? On second thought, I'll have a cup of apple cider. Perfection. The state of being complete and correct in every way. Could have said gum would be nice, could have said I'll have a stick, but no, 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 no. Stick. A long, thin piece of something. We can say, a stick of something. For example, a stick of gum. I loathe myself. <laughs> loathe. To hate. Blow a bubble. A bubble's good. Blow a bubble. It's got a, uh, boyish charm. It's impish. Boyish charm. Used to describe behavior that is like that of a boy that makes you attract someone. Impish. Showing a child's pleasure in enjoying yourself and making trouble. Nice going, imp. Nice going. Well done. Good job. Sometimes it can also be used sarcastically to mean the opposite. Imp. 
A child that behaves badly, but in a way that is funny rather than serious. Okay, okay, it, it, it's okay. All I need to do is reach over and put it back in my mouth. Reach over to stretch out your arm in order to get or touch something. We're back on track and I'm chewing someone else's gum. <laughs> on track. Making progress and likely to succeed. Chew. To bite something with your teeth, usually in order to taste its flavor. And now you're choking. <laughs> Choke. You stop breathing because something is blocking your throat. No, you gotta whip it. Whip. To hit something with a whip. I had a great blackout. <laughs> blackout. A time when there is no light or power because of an electricity failure. And, uh, I don't know if you got any of that, but I would really like a copy of the tape. Chandler was talking to the CCTV and requested for a copy of the tape. Why? Because Jill Goodacre kissed him. If you like our lessons, consider going premium. With New Academy Premium, you can have access to all the premium exercises in our English learning app. The exercises are exclusively written for the English lessons which will definitely reinforce what you've learned.